Okay, in this video, I'll show you how to color value for your op art project. First, you need to choose a color set, so I kind of went with analogous colors here, and as you can see, I've already started to color value. And if you look, value is the lightness and darkness of a color. So if you notice, towards the edge, it's dark, and then as I go towards the center, it gets lighter and lighter and lighter till it's almost white in the center. And that gives us the illusion of depth. And it makes it look like these uh, little tendril-like things look like uh, they're sticking up and, and, and going around. So how do I color? Well, let me show you. First, I like to start light because you can always go darker. You color with the line. I like to do both sides first. Very light. And then what I do is I start to get darker on the outside here. So you start dark on the outside and then you get lighter as you go inside. And basically what you're doing is you are letting up on your colored pencil or crayon, whatever material you have as you go to make it darker or lighter. So as you let up, it gets lighter and lighter. So you have that light to darkness going on. Whatever color set you chose uh, will work like that. So start off light. Just like that. And then around the edge, start getting darker. and lighter as you go in. And I'm just barely touching the paper as I'm coloring towards the center. And that gives you that light to dark that you want for your op art project. Uh, I hope you guys are having a great day. I hope you enjoy the video and uh, can't wait to see your artwork. See you later, peace.